Welcome back to Celebrity Big Brother and our second live eviction. Tonight, five of our fabulous celebrities face eviction. Cheryl, Colleen, Julian, Prince Lorenzo, and the situation are all hoping that they don't move from the A-list to the Z-list. And you've been voting to save your favorite. However, the voting has now frozen. Please do not call as your vote won't be counted and you may still be charged. Lines will be reopening later in the show. If you're watching us on Channel 5 Plus One or on demand, don't vote, you're too late. Before we reveal who you've saved, let's get back to yesterday's action and Cheryl is talking about her underwear calendar. It's okay, it's not what you think. Eleven fifty a.m. Cheryl is packing her smalls ahead of tomorrow's eviction. Twenty-five, twenty-six, thirty-seven. I could stay here twenty-eight more days. Martin, Prince Lorenzo, and Julian are enjoying the sun. Julian, are you all right? Yeah, in what, in what respect? Just the whole last night deal. I mean, it's hard enough for me talking to people all the time. <laughs> yeah. But then this sort of makes you have to talk to them in a different way, doesn't it? Yeah. That you're, what, that you're slightly worried about what people have said. Things are different when you're nominated. <laughs> I can't tell you. Just... When you're a dead man walking. Yeah, it's sort of... Um, it's not different. Don't you think I feel very different about everything? I don't. It can't be that bad. They I can't suppose be I like... feel like I don't have the energy to go around making campaigning for people to like campaigning, me. You know, yeah. I just can't be doing no, it. No, I just just keep. I don't think having fun. I'd rather go just, home. I think it's it's far better way of campaigning is just being yourself. No one betrayed anybody. No, no, I don't feel betrayed or anything. So it's nothing that serious. Yeah, I don't. I, I you know I knew it was going to happen either this round or next for me. It's the game, it's mm. how it works. I was a bit bored the last few days. Right, right, now, yeah, it's picked up a bit. Yes. Yeah. And the game has started, so it's yeah. really nice. Yes. <laughs> 12.57 p.m. Prince Lorenzo has made an alarming discovery. I found, like, a couple grey hairs today. Wow. I'm bummed out, like, on my side here. Just right? Tell me I don't have very many. Oh, yeah. No, what do you mean, oh, yeah? Yeah, you have. How many? Well, let me see. Pull out the illegal No, you've got about 15. Come on. God's on it, honestly. Do you want me to dye it? No, I want you to get them. I love grey hair. I love all grey I do on a man. Damn. You know how we all stay up late, late yeah. together, right? Yeah. They always have before. But all of a sudden, once Reen, Reen was safe and Danica and none of them were up, they went to sleep. And the boys stayed up, Julie stayed up, you were up, Cheryl was up. The people, like, it's almost like I feel like, not that I've been played, but I've been, I haven't been playing a game, you know what I mean? But I would hope that wasn't, you know, the case. But the same thing happened to Ashley. Ashley was for, there with Faria, and as soon as she was safe and not, and not nominated again, she was like, peace. <laughs> oh, dear. You know, and you, I'm sure you could tell I genuinely like the girl. Oh, oh right? Mm. I was being genuine. She's probably the first girl that I liked in, like, five years. I didn't know how neutral it was, though, from her side. Harvey said that it, you know, you know, almost like... Fool me once, you know? You ever heard that saying? Yes, I find it very interesting, all the sort of ebb and flow of groups and relationships. And If I was your best friend and I was up, right, you would be outside with me, right? Who was? Julie. So you must be feeling... Disappointed? Yes. Yeah, like, because if she was up, I would be out there with her. If Harvey was up, I was up. The Harvey waited up for me. Uh, Ashley waited up for me. Like, I think they're they, quite hard, those girls, you know, they you know what they want in life. I think it's because... Which I quite admire, you know, I quite like tough people. Cut through? 
Well, there's a fine line, isn't there? Yeah. Three thirty-four p.m. Nominee Colleen has come to talk to Big Brother. It's a weird feeling when you're nominated because you kind of do spend the day looking round, thinking, "Who doesn't like me or who doesn't get on with me?" You know, I really hope when we get out, you know, we're all friendly and we all have a good drink and go, "Wow, what an experience that was!" And it is. It's every day. Sometimes I go through times of, "Oh, I'm bored." And then I look round and think, I'm in bloody Big Brother. That's cool. Man. <laughs> Getting down with the kids. Are you all right about the nomination thing? Oh, yeah, 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 I'm totally okay. I was just saying that what is, like, difficult about it, I think what people really don't like... You don't know who's nominated no, you? No, it's not that. I, I mean, I have an idea who did with me. I, I didn't nominate you. No, well, thank you, thank you. I'll I tell didn't... you straight out. I hope you know that I tell you that no, well, I know. There's no reason for me to nominate you. Well, thank you. But what hurts people, you know, you can't just say because I don't know them. Yeah. you got to give, like, a brutal reason about why you want them out. Yeah, in no uncertain terms, why right. this person is flawed. Julian and Julie are talking about their fellow housemates. They need to man up those those children. And the situ is still dreadfully upset. I mean, he was in tears. In tears? No, he was last night. Because Dana Garden sat with him. But I never thought she liked him very much anyway. <laughs> she doesn't. <laughs> well, you know. But. Well, I know I can see their point of view. <laughs> but those girls, yeah. you know. Mm. They um, did what they had to do, didn't they? Yeah. Got what they wanted. Mm. And then, mm. fuck off. <laughs> but I don't think uh, those two particular boys are used to that. No. Next round of evictions. They'll be sorry, and they'll stop being nice to them again. <laughs> well. Then it'll be too late. Oh, I don't know. Well, you're not going. I wouldn't mind, you know. I would be lost. What have I got in common with anybody else? Well, they will love you. Don't be ridiculous. You can have lovely, cheery chats with Samantha. I don't want them. I'm sure she said something interesting last Friday. When? But nothing since. Last Friday. see their own show coming. Julia and Julian do lunch. That's pitching and lunch. It's crunch time. You've made your decision. It's time to talk to the house. Big Brother house, this is Brian. Cheryl. Nice. Colleen. <laughs> Julian. <laughs> Prince Lorenzo. Oh, the situation. Right. Your time yeah. has come. All right, guys, I'll see you later. For the last two days, the great British public have been voting to save. I can now reveal in no particular order the two celebrities with the most votes and who are therefore safe from tonight's eviction are... Julian. safe from eviction is the situation <laughs> Julian and the situation congratulations you are safe 
Cheryl, yep. Colleen, Prince Lorenzo. Ooh. You are not safe. And the next person to leave the celebrity Big Brother house <sighs> will be revealed later tonight. Oh, 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 man. oh my God. You are kidding well. me, blood. Are you serious? I don't like hearing the cheers and the boos. I don't. That's no, that's horrible. horrible. How they cut that out, like? But that doesn't portray the whole of the next. Yeah, it doesn't portray it. It's not it portraying really anything. So, Julian and the situation are safe. But Cheryl, Colleen and Prince Lorenzo are not, and the voting has now reopened. If you don't want your favourite housemate to be next out, you need to vote. From a landline call at 0901 61617 and add the number of the housemate you want to save. From a mobile call 65058 and add the number of your favourite housemate. To save Cheryl, add 02. To save Colleen, add 03. To save Prince Lorenzo, add 10. Calls cost no more than 36p from a BT landline and any mobile. Calls from other landlines may vary. Voting closes in tonight's show. Votes cast after the lines close won't count. Full terms go to channel5.com slash bbvote. And if you're watching us on Channel 5 Plus One or on demand, don't vote. You're too late. We'll be back after the short break.